test microphone. <clears throat> testing, testing, one, two. Oh, yeah. We are live at the National Lottery Draw. Boom, 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 boom. We are using set of balls number three this evening, and the independent adjudicator is Jennifer Field. Now over to Mylene Class to push the millionaire maker button. Ray Good luck. Can oh. you hear me? Yeah, Sean. Oh, fucking mute button. Yeah, yeah. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Oh, yeah, it's nice to see you. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, the flat seems real empty without you. Yeah. Yeah. There's a, there's a, there's a weird smell, actually, that's popped up the last few days. Oh? Yeah, but I won't, I won't worry about it, because do you remember that, like, big bag of uh, frozen jumbo sausages that we had? Well, I just fry some of them now, and it seems to, like... Um, Mask it? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so it just kind of... Well, it just smells like sausages now, so... Oh! Oh! Wouldn't it be so cool if there was like a share smell button and you could, you could sniff it yourself? I know what sausages smell like, Graham. Yeah. How, 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 how is it with the family then? Yeah, it's good. Uh, I'm just glad I managed to get here in time. What? In time. Oh, not this again. <laughs> not what? You know what you're doing. I, I, Sean, we, 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 just, we just both know that you knew that the lockdown was going to be announced before you left. I didn't know that, though, did I? I was packing, then I jumped in the car as it was being announced. Okay, sure. If that's, if that's your story, then, 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 then that's your story. Well, that's what do happened. You, do you want to know so... what I think happened? Not really. You knew damn well that the lockdown was going to be announced and you thought to yourself, oh, I can't spend weeks alone in this flat with Graham. I've, I've, I've got to get out of here. So you just, you packed up your stuff and, and you went on your prearranged trip to your parents. It was prearranged. <sighs> wow. <laughs> you know I'm alone here, right? Yes. Unbelievable. You know, sometimes, Sean, and I, and I mean so, only sometimes, but still, oh, I just feel like you see this place as somewhere to sleep and nothing else. What? December 2016, okay? I put up an advert for a room. You see said advert and reply. Why? I can't remember. Yeah, okay, I'll tell you why. Because it was a good price and a decent location. Isn't that why most people respond to an Yes, advert? yes, but I don't want, I didn't want most people, did I? I wanted a flat mate. Emphasis on the mate. We are mates, oh, Graham. Well, oh, a few things in the last year just make me question that. Just, just, just a little bit. Okay. For the last time, it's not normal to buy your male roommates bath bombs for his birthday. You know, I was here when I opened them. That's right. Tore into the wrapping paper to reveal the cosy night bath bomb set in front of my parents. Along with a gift card that said, Happy Bubble Day. The meal afterwards was so awkward. You know what, Sean? It's not even about the bath bombs, okay? The cheese board was a real kick in the teeth. I sent you a text that day saying I had a surprise for you, okay? You came home, you got changed, and you left immediately. I had a date. An actual date. What was I supposed to say? Sorry, I can't come out tonight. My flatmate Graham's put together a continental cheese. Yeah, 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 you could have brought her over. We could have eaten beautiful cheese together. It would have been so... Strange. It would have been incredibly... Incredibly strange. Yeah, well, it just seems ungrateful to me. It's not. And I do appreciate lots of things. It's just... Sometimes I find it a bit odd. 
Look, I'm wearing the jeans you told me to buy. And you were right. They fit really well. And Especially around the... Yeah, around, around the back backside. Yeah. No, you... Uh, yeah, they, uh, they look great. They look great. Thanks. Um, so how, uh, what, what are you having for dinner tonight? Dad says he's going to do something. You? Oh, yes. Sausages. Huh. Yeah. Well, hopefully I'll be able to come home soon. Maybe we could go out for a meal or something. Yeah, 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 that would be nice. That would be nice. We, we, we could share a bottle of wine and uh, talk about the old days. What old days? <laughs> you know, like when we, uh, when we, when we went on that ghost train on, on, in the fair. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was drunk that night, wasn't I? Yeah, yeah you were. <laughs> And, and I was a little bit drunk as well. I'd had a, I'd had a bit. I, I just you. didn't see that zombie <laughs> coming out. I was so scared. I don't remember. I don't remember a zombie. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You remember when when I screamed and I held your hand? Oh yeah, I remember, I remember that. Oh, that was a nice day. Oh, I've uh, I've cleaned your bed sheets, by the way, so they'll be lavender fresh for when you get back. Mm. What? Just the two of us. We can make it if we try. Just the two of us. Just the two of us. Just the two of us. Building them castles in the sky. Just the two of us. You and I.